This military report is brought to you by Coleman University. They hiked 23 miles through the North County Mountains, and that was just the start of a grueling test of endurance. 10 News reporter Craig Herrera takes us inside the Camp Pendleton Recon Challenge and the men they honor. This is just one part of a 29.4 mile course for these Marines. Teams of two hurdled obstacles, climbed ropes, crawled along bars, then packed up and continued on a 23 mile hike through the rugged terrain of Camp Pendleton. This was the fifth annual recon challenge. Laura Paragon's kids made a course of their own, waiting for their dad, Chief Warrant Officer Keith Paragon. We support him and this is a, this is a very big event for him. They caught up with him Hi. at the pool. Hey. Good job. Hello. Good luck. Good At this point in the game, an M240 machine gun is disassembled and submerged into the deep. Each team is almost at the end. Now they're diving into a 15-foot hole. You can hear Laura explaining to her kids what dad is doing in the water. Yes, they have to put it together underneath the water. They gathered the pieces and assembled it underwater. And once they resurfaced, the gun was checked to make sure it worked properly. Paragon and his teammate dedicated the challenge to a friend they lost several years ago. So they have his name on the back of their packs. This entire event was dedicated to the men who died in combat or training. This is what these guys do on a daily basis. They, they, they live it, they breathe it. This is who they are. This is not just a training event to them. This is their way of life. At Camp Pendleton, yeah. Craig Herrera, 10 News. Amazing. 20 teams of two competed in this year's Marine Reconnaissance Challenge. The fastest time turned in was just over six hours.